So Matt, how does it feel to be back at St James' Park? Yeah, it was a little bit of a surreal feeling to be honest. Um, getting off the bus and coming in and going into the away change room, obviously I know it's, uh, it's a bit different to, to last time I was here, but no, it, was, it, felt, it felt really good. And we, we see you doing really well at Swansea. Do you get lots of ma messages from from Exeter City fans? When you, obviously you picked up four awards at the end of the last season from Swansea. Do you get lots of goodwill messages from Exeter City fans? Yeah, I get a few. A few. I think um, I think a few fans uh, keep an eye out for how I'm doing, and that that just is a great testament to the club. Obviously, it's a, a family-based club, and and that's one of the reasons why I enjoyed my time so much here. Obviously, being a being a homegrown lad as well, and yeah, I, I appreciate all the love. In terms of the Exeter City side that were out there today, you had a good battle in midfield with Archie Collins and then of course the likes of uh, Jack Sparks, Joel Randall and a, and a few others coming on at the end. It just sh shows you that what good work the Exeter City Academy is doing in producing players like yourself and those that have come behind you. Yeah, of course. I always keep my eye out for um, for the lads that are playing, the, the youngsters coming through. I thought Archie's a really good player. I thought he played really well today. Um, and yeah, it's easy to see that um, obviously, uh, you're keeping the youngsters coming through, which is a massive part of the football club. What did you make of uh, Exeter City's performance today? Yeah, no, I thought I thought they um, I thought they used the strikers really well. They were difficult to to get hold of and get around, and, and some of the passing football they played was was really good as well. Obviously, you can see uh, after the last two three years that they're wanting to get out of this league. I think that they're better than League Two, um, and they they got some really good players, and I think they just need to show and get out. Excellent. Uh, thank you, Matt. We wish you all the best with Swansea this season. Thank you very much, mate. What's up, man?